Okay guys, it's been about a week since I've moved into my new apartment. There's like a crazy storm, so the wind is really, really loud. And there's a bus. <laughs> okay, I've done a whole bunch of errands today. Like I woke up and I got out, I filled up my car with gas. I was so nervous that it was gonna jump up a lot more, so I I literally woke up at 7.30 and the first thing I did was leave to go fill up my car because I would not be surprised if it's significantly higher by the end of today or tomorrow. So that was fun. And then I went and got some essentials like eggs and almond milk and some oatmeal. I haven't gotten dressed nice or anything since like moving here because it's been spring break. And yeah, I've only gone to work and I work at a bakery so not just the cutest. I'm also trying to get this to go away. I think it's induced by stress. I got it really bad. I've had it for about like two, three months, especially when I went through some really hard things then with my mom passing. It's just like, poof, and it won't go away. So I've been using Curology, but I've been using it for quite some time, very diligently, like very diligently. And it's, I can see it helping a little bit, but not as much as I would like it to. So I think another thing that it could be is maybe like my increase of sugar because <laughs> I am one of those people that when I'm emotional, I, I like to eat. <laughs> and so recently I have eaten a lot more sugar than I normally do and working out less. So it's like not a good balance. So I think that could be it. It could just be because life is kind of crazy. So yeah. <laughs> So I think I'm going to get ready to go work out and then I have to practice the violin because I need to be more dil diligent at that and yeah, I probably won't even end up posting this because I've been talking for six minutes and I don't know if anybody will listen to this, but these are more of the type of videos that I want to do just like daily in the life, like follow me along in my life and just being able to talk because when you live alone, you don't talk much to people. So I'm talking to a camera, <laughs> so yeah. Let's do this. Losing time, I'm fading fast. I just wanna make it last. Okay, I'm just putting my shoes on right now. And then we'll head down to the gym. I also need to do something with my hair because it's kind of crazy. But yeah, I will have to say it is super convenient having a gym just right downstairs. I really love it because I can procrastinate working out instead of like scheduling out such a big chunk of my day to drive down to the gym. I remember everybody would tell me, oh, like appreciate how it is now when you don't have to worry about eight million things. And I never, like, I always like, okay, yeah, I'll appreciate it. But I never realized how real it was. Like there is not enough time in the day for everything, especially like when I'm working and going to school, like, School takes up all of my free time, and then I'm only working part-time, which is painful because <laughs> it's not cheap to live on your own. So, I'm all ready. I'm gonna fix my hair. I've got my earphones, and then my keys, because I don't want to get locked out. Also, it is so cold in my room. Losing time, I'm fading fast I just wanna make it last Try to let go of the past I close my eyes, embrace the blast Sleepless nights and headaches stack Restlessness to hell and back What's my purpose, what do I grab? A slippery surface, a heart attack And sometimes you just gotta believe There's something that'll give you relief Okay, I just finished I'm ready to go take a shower Just got out of the shower, so now I'm going to do my face. I'm learning this super hard bow stroke, and it's like I have to get eight notes into one bow, and it's really tedious, and it's hard. It's funny, I have been playing the violin for like many, many years. I started when I was pretty young, but I'm like, I'm not crazy good. So I started taking private lessons because I wanted to get better. I wanted to be able to tell people I played, 
and be proud of what I play. And little did I know that I played so wrong. Like I held the bow wrong and I held the violin wrong. And so we've just been trying to like correct old bad habits. It's crazy how years of habits are so hard to break. Instructor always says, he says, so this is the hand that like makes all the notes and this is the hand that like plays. And he's like, which hand is more important? And in my head, it was always the one that played the notes. But if you're not holding the bow and the bow never touches the string, you're never gonna get sound. So we're correcting my left hand and making that like perfect so that we can work on my right hand. And he's not too worried about me catching on with my right hand because I listen very well. <laughs> so yeah, it's just been tedious, but I'm hoping that I'll get there. And yeah, so now I'm gonna start with my like curology thing. <laughs> Obviously I'm not sponsored, but <laughs> I've been trying it. I'm so desperate to get rid of this. It hasn't really been working. I mean, yeah, I don't know. I don't, I don't know if it's worked, but I've been doing it so good for like a month. So I did my cleanser in the shower and then I'm just going to put on my formula. I'm going to put on my moisturizer and then I'm going to put on some spot patches to try to help this take away. So. If you guys have any tips on how to like, how you were able to clear up your acne, let me know. I honestly didn't really struggle with acne much. I, this has always been my problem area, but I was on birth control for a long time and it did wonders for my skin. So now I'm like dealing with all the acne that I never had to deal with. <laughs> And the thing that makes me sad is I know that this is going to leave a ton of scarring and like there's not much I can do about that, but it'll be fine, <laughs> you know, it happens. So I'm going to let this dry. I never know how long to let it dry. My hair always looks a bit funky while it's wet. It was so funny. I always had the longest hair and the most annoying thing in my life is having long, wet hair. So having short hair, it's so much more manageable because it's not like draping on your back and your clothes aren't soaking wet. Let me know girls or guys if that is a pet peeve of yours because it is huge for me. It bothers me so much. I always like put my stuff on two parts. I do like the top part of my face and then the second part of my face. I will have to say this is the most diligent I've ever been with like a face routine. So normally I'm just like, normally I never had to worry about it. So hopefully I don't have to do this for forever, but it's kind of nice, like it feels good. <laughs> Especially like waking up and washing your face. That is, that is satisfying. These little things are pretty dang cool. They're just little spot patches. You leave on for like six to 12 hours and it literally just like pulls the stuff out of your acne without you having to like pop it and like damage your skin. It's wild, but I love them. So like I just put it right there, like you can see it, but it's not like horrible. I'll have this on for the rest of the video. I'm gonna do one more because I've got one like right there. <laughs> okay, hopefully that works. Let's go practice violin because I need I need to do it. Isn't this cutest little music room? <laughs> I love it. I'm honestly so glad they have this room because there's probably no way I would practice in front of my roommates. Well, obviously not in front, but you know what I mean. I would feel too bad, especially because I don't know if they're studying or anything like that. So now I'm just going to try to practice and get down a few of these bow strokes. Wow. Okay, now I'm going to practice and try to get down some of the techniques that I've been working on. So... I'm getting my shifting down on my A and my E string. I haven't even attempted the D and the G, but pretty proud. <laughs> I 
All right, I'm gonna stop this here so that I don't use all my storage, but I'll see you guys when I'm done. Okay, I'm gonna try to make, I forgot I had these on. I'm gonna try to make some sweet potato fries because I have sweet potatoes I wanna use, but I'm pretty sure, I don't know if I'll have the kitchen to myself, so I'll probably just film it and you can just listen to it. <laughs> Sorry about that. Losing time, I'm fading fast I just wanna make it last Try to let go of the past I close my eyes, embrace the blast Sleepless nights and headaches stack Restlessness to hell and back What's my purpose, what do I grab? I'm pretty proud of this Thanks to my dad for the leftover meat I added some barbecue sauce too Because it does look a little dry At least my salad Not the meat and stuff But <clears throat> Normally I'll sit like right here and just stare out the window But you guys won't be able to see me because I have to turn the lights off to do that So yeah I honestly love filming these videos so far It's such like I don't know when you're at this age 21 <laughs> I don't know from like 18 to I don't even know how long it's gonna feel but when you just have this age where you're trying to figure out adulthood, like figuring out the like logistics is pretty easy. But like it is lonely not living with your siblings or your family. I guess if you're an only child, you might know what that's like. But yeah, it's different. So I like it though, because I think we're all built to like grow up and to be independent at some point in our lives. But yeah. I'm really lucky because my working environment is so good, so that's a really good outlet for me. But days like today when I don't work, if I didn't go visit my dad, I probably wouldn't have <laughs> spoken to anyone. So yeah, living here has been helpful because I see a lot more people than I normally do, and I have a lot more options of what to do. So yeah, I feel really good about moving here. And then yeah. Also, we are at 52 subscribers, I think, right now, which <laughs> makes me so proud. Let's try to get up to 100. I think that would be awesome. And yeah, let's just build this little family because I'm loving it so much and I hope you guys are too. I'm going to start opening up more and being more natural. I am a pretty mellow person. <laughs> so like, I feel like today is the most like me vlog you're going to see. Well, normally like the beginning of my vlogs, I'm pretty like hesitant, but by the end of it, I'm like, ah, oh, it's normal. But yeah, let me know if you guys have any questions for me. I would love to get to know you guys, so please like just message in the comments. I'll respond. <laughs> and yeah. Normally I have my salads with hummus, but I ate it all. I don't have any dressings. <laughs> it's so funny when you move out, you realize how much you don't have. Like I just bought pepper and salt <laughs> because I made dinner yesterday. And I didn't have any seasonings, like, I took some from my dad's. <laughs> I did the whole shopping at my parents' house. But I didn't- I took cinnamon, garlic powder, and like a few of like the fry seasonings and stuff, but I didn't have salt and pepper. <laughs> and then I don't have like any baking ingredients, like I love to bake, but I don't have flour, I don't have sugar, I don't have baking powder, baking soda. So, <laughs> I'm just waiting to like slowly build up. I mean, I'm really, really fortunate. I got a pretty good food storage because my dad is amazing. <laughs> I just went through his pantry. But other than that, it's more just like the fresh stuff that I have to worry about now and the baking stuff because I don't have that. I also don't have baking sheet. I have a cookie sheet, but I don't have like cupcakes or um, a cake pan. <laughs> so these are so good. I love love sweet potatoes so much and honestly the barbecue sauce really complements them <laughs> but do any of you have any fun things coming up like i know it's spring break for me but is it spring break for most of everyone else <laughs> also i really hope i don't get another bloody nose <laughs> and yeah, what are you guys studying in school, if you're in school, or if you're working, or if you're just doing your own thing? I'm probably going to wrap this up here. 
unless I decide to do anything fun. <laughs> Probably not. I think I'm just gonna watch some YouTube and go to bed. <laughs> so, thank you for watching. I love you all. I love everyone who is supporting me. And let me know how I can support any of you guys. Yeah, I love you all. And I will see you in my next video.